I received this charging block uh, thing from the seller to review and thought I would do a quick video about it. Comes with the device itself, which we'll dig into a pouch to hold it. Uh, it's a nice pouch, though I don't know why I would use it. And then of course a USB-C, it's a USB-C cable. The way this thing works is it's got a magnetic charger for your newer iPhones. Uh, I'm recording this with my iPhone, so I can't show you. Uh, it's got an Apple Watch charging platform right there. Uh, and then on the back, it's got a little stand to it, right? So you can use it on your desk as a nice little display stand. Uh, so going around the sides, and this is a, um, there we go, it's a 10,000 mAh bank, and there's the charging output right there. You can see the different inputs and outputs. So on the top, you can see it says out or in, USB-C out or in to charge devices that use USB-C. Uh, you have USB type A out to whatever charging cable that you have. On the side here is the power button. Right, just turn it on. LED indicator on the top to show the charge. And then on this side, oops, sorry. And on this side is the uh, a micro USB in. All right, so you can use the USB-C cable to charge it. Let me shut that off here. Yeah. Anyway, you can use the USB-C cable to charge it or a, a micro USB cable if you happen to have one laying around. So this is a good device and it charges things pretty quick. Uh, I do have one issue with it that you probably need to be mindful of. I was gonna use this as kind of a, uh, a nightstand kind of stand, but my Apple Watch has got an aftermarket strap on it, right? Which doesn't lay flat. So because it doesn't lay flat, I can't, I can't use this if I set this up on its, kind of hard to do things one-handed. If I set this up as a kind of a stand, I, it won't, it doesn't have enough magnetization or magnetic properties to hold it in place. So what I've been doing is just popping, popping the Apple Watch out of the strap and there you go. And then it's going to charge it. And then, of course, it's really easy to just pop it right back in because it's, you know, this is like a silicone rubbery material. So that is a downside. And uh, obviously, this charges both your Apple Watch and your phone at the same time. But uh, if you don't have an aftermarket band or if you have a watch strap that lays flat, then uh, you're going to be good. Well, don't break that. Thanks again to the seller for sending me this product to review.